Kane in the house. You ready for this? Here we go. We all need a story to show us how to live, to tell us who we are, our meta-narrative. The Bible tells our story and we've a part to play. It's a story of redemption and creation to Judgment Day. The story is a long one. It has six different parts. It tells about Yahweh whose love is off the chart. Yes. Chapter 1 is creation. God created everything. The world was as bright and shiny as my blame. Man and woman in the garden and everything was good. All in perfect harmony, the way God knew it could. Cut. Chapter 2 is the coup, man rebelled against God. After all he did for them, that seemed a little odd. The serpent was a tempter and was on the attack. They ate forbidden fruit and it all went whack. Whack! It all went whack! It all went whack! Chapter 3 is Covenants. God made Israel his own with land law and a king to sit on David's throne. They were there to light the way, but sin made their light dim. They were taken into exile, it was light out for them. Chapter 4 is the Christ. God sent his son to save. All mankind was lost and wouldn't be hey. hell. Jesus died for our sins and rose to make us free. Salvation by faith for them, you and me. Me! Them, you and me! Them, you and me! Chapter 5 is the church, the body of God's Son. People of every tribe, whose freedom Christ has won. The church is on a mission to make disciples of the lost, to spread the gospel near and far, no matter what the cost. Chapter 6 is consummation, when God's plan is complete. A new heaven and earth, after Jesus' judgment seat. Tears and death will be no more, and life will never end. All that's wrong will be made right by Christ, our Lord and friend. This is redemption story, our present, future, past. It can show you the way a living that will last. The story of redemption is our own story too. God wants to have us in it. So how about you? So how about you? So how about you? So how about you?